Good morning, good morning, good morning, good morning. Good morning, everybody. Good morning, good morning, good morning, good morning. Now it's telling me I'm live. Good morning, good morning, good morning. Good morning, glory to God. Glory, glory. How y'all doing this morning? How y'all doing? How y'all doing? Yes, Father. We thank you, Lord Jesus. For the abundance of rain this morning we thank you father for the abundance of this harvest on this morning we give you glory honor and praise for what is to come on this day we thank you father we thank you father oh glory be to god there is a blessing in the house on this morning glory to god for the blessing in the house this morning he's given us more resources he's given us more abundance he's supplying us with more needs we thank him this morning for the abundance we thank him this morning for the harvest we thank him for the souls we thank him for the kingdom assignment glory 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 hallelujah yeah 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 no song this morning no song this morning i've been up this morning and i've been hearing for he has won it all for us we thank him for winning it this morning. We thank him for victory. We thank him for high praise. We thank him for the authenticness that he's bringing forth in the earth realm. We give him glory, honor, and praise this morning. Hallelujah. For he is our healer. He is our way maker. He is our source. He is everything that we need him to be. Yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. Good morning, sister. Hey, God, we thank you. We thank you. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. We give him glory this morning. We give him honor this morning. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. We thank him. We thank him for life and life more abundantly this morning. We thank him for the abundance that he has in the atmosphere for us this morning. We give him glory because there is Urababashikadarabashanda. There is a more than enough in the spirit realm. I've been hearing the word more resources, more supplies, more needs being met. There's more, more, more in the atmosphere this morning. Can you grab your more this morning? He's been telling me more, more, more. All weekend, he's been saying more. He's been saying exceedingly. He's been saying surpluses. He's been saying the abundance of rain, that there is more in the house. There is a more in the house. Glory be to God. There is more in the house, y'all. Hallelujah. There is a more than enough in the house. I'm just waiting in charge of the atmosphere because I feel a more. I feel the sun is about to shine in somebody's gloomy day. I feel the sun is about to bring forth another light in somebody's life. There was a moment of darkness, but I feel the sun of God. I feel the sun of God moving in this morning. Hallelujah, hallelujah, hallelujah. Somebody was going through a moment of depression. Somebody was going through a moment of anxiety. Somebody was going through a moment of withdrawal. Somebody was going through a moment of sorrow. But I feel the Holy Ghost uh, moving in the room, uh, saying your sorrow days uh, is over because the joy of the Lord is your strength. I feel God's joy moving in the house. What was meant to set you back, what was meant to move you out of your posture of praise, I feel the Holy Ghost in this morning. I feel a move of God in the house this morning. Glory, 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 glory. Hallelujah, y'all. Yeah, 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 yeah. 
I feel God's glory moving in the room this morning. Hey, ba 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 ha. Yeah, 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 yeah. I feel a supercharger in the spirit realm. I feel somebody got new strength to run on. I feel more than enough is in the room this morning. I feel it. Hey, yeah, 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 yeah. I feel more than enough is in the room. I feel more than enough is in the room. I feel more. I feel more of you in the room. I feel more of God in the room. I feel more of your presence in the room. I feel more of your glory in the room. I feel more of your strength in the room. I feel more in the room. I feel more in the room. What happens when more come in the room? It's an anabashiand. More, more. I feel more in the spirit, y'all. Hallelujah. Come on, what happens? When you got lack, he give you more. He becomes the source. He becomes the supplier. More is your portion for today. More is my portion for today. Hallelujah. More, more. What happens in the word more? More means overflow. More means exceeding. More means more, 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 more. More means there is an overflow. More means there is a more than enough in my pocketbook. More means there's more enough in my bank account. More, more, more. My seeds just multiplied and more manifested. My family's salvation just multiplied and there's more souls being added to the kingdom. There is a more, more, more in the atmosphere. Come on here. There is more in the atmosphere. We got to call for our more in the atmosphere. More. He supply more of my needs. He give me more of my desires. He give me more of my wants. He gives me more. Hallelujah. He gives me more. He gives me more. He gives me more. Come on. I feel it in my spirit. He gives me more. He gives me more than what I need. He gives me more than what I ask for. He gives me more, more, more. Hallelujah. More, more. Come on. We're going to prophesy that. More is my portion. Ooh, mama, my shianda. More is my portion. More is my portion. Come on. I got more than enough. Hallelujah, shianda. I got more than enough. Oh, la la ba ha. I got more than enough. Yeah, 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 yeah. I got more than enough. I have more than enough. Come on. My children got more than enough. It can no 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 my shianda. Come on. My children got more than enough. We prophesied in more. We prophesied in more. I got more than enough. My children got more than enough. My grandchildren got more than enough. My spouse got more than enough. My parents got more than enough. It can no 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 my shianda. There's a divine assignment of more. Hey yeah 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 yeah. More more more. It can no 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 bo shiata. Glory, there is more. 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 la ba ba shata. And as I'm hearing the word more, 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 I begin to define more as we're talking. The definition according to the dictionary.com, it says more is greater, an additional amount. So what's happening? My greater is more. My greater is more. Come on. The Holy Ghost told us last week that greater has arrived. So what just arrived in our greater? More just arrived in my greater. More just arrived in my greater. What happens in my more? More lump sums. More surpluses. More. More exceedingly. More overflow. More rivers, more streams, more souls. Come on, there is a more. I'm trying to get to what God gave me, but I hear the Holy Ghost saying, there is more. There is more of you. There is more of you. There is more of you. He's requiring more 
in your greater. He's requiring more in your elevation. He's requiring more in your transformation. He's requiring more in the manifestation of your prayer life. He is requiring more. You got to see the greater more that is within your loins. You got to understand that your words has greater power. There is more power in your words. There is more authority in your spirit. There is a more. There is a more in your belly. When they told you you was going to be in lack, the Holy Ghost said there is more. There is more. Come on. What does he say? When the word increase comes, more is added. When the word increase comes, come on, more is added. When the word says multiply, more is added. When he said additional, he said more. When he said greater, he said more. When he said it, he meant word more manifested. There is a more of an increase. There is a more of an exceeding. There is a more, more resources is available. More, hallelujah. More, more, more. More, <laughs> more, 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 more. Sisters, can y'all look at what I just looked down to in the chat? The person is chatting and saying, how old are you? Forever 25. Hallelujah. Today is actually my birthday, sir. And I am forever 25. My birthday is today. And I am forever 25. No matter what my horrible shot, my birth certificate say, I'm forever 25, y'all. Come on. I celebrate my more today. Oh, my God. He's giving me more. More years added to my life. Come on. What about, oh, my God. Thank you, Holy Ghost. We got a more years added to our life. He said longevity and good health is, is our portion. So guess what? We got more years, more longevity, more good health. Thank you, Holy Ghost. He didn't know what he was just setting up in the spirit. He needed to know my age, but I hear the Holy Ghost say, more years. Come on, y'all. We got more years to do the will of the Lord. We got more years to manifest things in the kingdom. We got more years to bring forth souls to the kingdom. We got more years for the dreams and visions to be ye fulfilled. There is more. There is more. More. More, more. Thank you, sister. There is more life within us. Come on. We got more abundant life. More abundant life. Thank you. Thank you. More abundant life. There is a more in my life. Oh, God. There is a more in my life. Hallelujah. There is more in your life. What is happening right now? We got more visions. We got more dreams. We got more business to birth. We got more things to do in the kingdom. There's more assignments for our lives in the earth room. Hallelujah, hallelujah, hallelujah. Let me get to where God had me this weekend, y'all. This weekend, the Holy Spirit was ministering to me about more resources. Last week, he gave us the word resources, but he brought it to us according to Philippians 4 and 19, that my God shall supply all of my needs according to his riches and glory. That was the resource scripture that he gave us last week. Philippians 4 and 19, that more will supply all our needs. That means more is coming to us according to Philippians 4 and 19. All that we need, more, it, we have needs. When things change, when our lifestyle changes, when the kingdom assignment changes, we need more resources. So more is coming to us. So on today, he gave me 1 Timothy 5 and 8. Over the weekend, there is more. There's more. So what is happening in today's scripture is we got more resources to provide for our family. Today's scripture identified with God is about to release more finances, more resources, more blessings for us to bless our family. We are about to be in the assignment and in the posture of the more is coming to us to help our family. Come on. We're on the assignment of more for our family lineage, y'all. And the funny thing was, the Holy Spirit brought me back to my years of my childhood. He brought me back to the years of my childhood, y'all, about the resources. And he was telling me that the resources that we need, hallelujah, help me, Holy Spirit. He was telling me that the resources that we need, 
he has already supplied them for us. But we got to look. We got to look and see in the way that God sees. Because the resources that we need for the next level, the resources that we need to birth for the next stream is in our homes already. Huh? That's what the Holy Ghost was dealing with me this morning. That you, I've given you an assignment to birth forth the vision. I've given you an assignment to birth forth the development. I've given you the assignment to go and achieve it. But you're telling me you need this, you need that. And the, what you need has already been brought to your house. Come on here, y'all. Thank you, thank you for the birthday wishes. He told me it was already in the house. And he took me back to a little girl, apostle. I believe you're going to be able to relate to this one with me. He took me back to a little girl when I would be with my grandmother. And my grandmother would use ivory soap in her house. And when my grandmother would finish with her bar of ivory soap, she had a jar in the bathroom. And I could never understand what was going on. But as the Holy Ghost ministered to me this weekend, he began to give me the revelation of what was happening in that jar. So in that jar, my grandmother would not throw away her old soaps that got small, the soap when it broken, she would take her soap and put it in that jar. So in my mind, as a little girl, I thought it was water at the bottom of the jar. But it wasn't water at the bottom of the jar. It was some type of solution, some type of oil at the bottom of that jar. And she kept on piling those soaps up in that jar, kept on piling those soaps up in that jar, putting the lid on it, sealing it. And what the Holy Ghost was telling me was she made the best of the resources that she had at that moment and so what was going on in that jar was my grandmother was creating another level to wash her body what was going on was that soap was going through a process when we all understand i wish i had a bar of soap when we all understand that the soap is solid we got a solid surface but when the soap got into that jar and that solution hit that soap over the time it was a process that was going on that was being done before my eyes but i couldn't understand the process because i was a little girl but god allowed my grandmother to go through the endurance the strength and the patience to let that product manifest so what happened was the soap and the solution became a new product so by the time it finished it processing it became a liquid solution in the jar. So what that liquid solution became was some body wash or some hand soap that my grandmother had created. Come on here. We got the resources in our houses to make the next level of products. Come on here. I was like, oh my Lord, I would have never thought of it as a little girl that as she was reproducing, re repurposing her bars of soap, she was creating her own body wash from broken pieces of soap. Come on here. We, I, my generation, come on. When that soap gets small, it goes in file 13. Because we don't have, we don't know nothing about that. Grandmother was doing it, but we didn't understand the purpose of what grandmother was doing. So God gave me the revelation that there is a process in the birth. And there is a process in the next level of your resources. Oh, my God. Hey, God. So what happened? Grandmother created a whole new product to not only take a bath with, but to soap in her hands. Grandmother was creating body wash and hand soap and all those recycled mason and mayonnaise jars. So she did not have to go to the store to buy any soap. It was all supplied for her what she needed. Then on top of that, he began to show me how we go to the store and we buy all these products and the resources was in the house and i was like oh my lord i didn't understand he said when you were going through in your life and you didn't have the money that you needed to buy the hair products that you needed to maintain your hair he said i showed you how some good old eggs and some good old mayonnaise can make a good hair conditioner and he just y'all was bringing me back to all these things that the resources that you need is already provided for you for those of you come on that want to go and open up a business 
to start baking, to start cooking. The grocery is already in the house. What you need to do is begin to have a house party. Begin to have a lunch party. Begin to have a party where you're going to cater the food and you ask the whole, excuse me, and you ask the Holy Ghost to send you the right guests that's going to go out and help launch the business. Come on. Your resources for your catering business is already in the house. You already got some pots. You already got some spoons. You already got some grocery in the freezer that you're saving that you have not yet cooked. He said the resources that you need for the catering business is already in the house. It's in the pantry. It's what you need. God has already given us everything that we need to supply the vision. He said the more resources is already there for you to open up a stream to bring forth new money into your house. Come on. He said, I need you to look at what I've already gave you to make it stretch and make it work. It's already there for you. All you got to do is see it so that you can see the finances come in. He said, I've given you everything that you need. And when God began to minister to me, I was like, oh, my Lord, unappreciative. That's, now, I'm not saying y'all was unappreciative. I'm not saying that. I'm saying that Kia was unappreciative because all along, I'm saying, Lord, I need this to relaunch Zion Goddess. Lord, I need this to research, I mean, to relaunch. And the Lord said, if you're going and looking in your shed, you'll see it. If you're going and looking in your storage, you'll see it. Everything that you need to relaunch is already provided for you. Just go and reorganize. That's what the Holy Ghost started telling me, y'all. He was saying the resources that you need is already in your possession. You just need to go and organize. You just need to get yourself together and open up your eyes and see what all I have already supplied you with to bring forth another level of stream. Hello, Holy Ghost. Yeah, 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 yeah. Woman of God said, my God, great revelation. Come on. He was giving me these revelations. You looking and asking and talking, but you need the financial resources to go out and buy new stuff. When you already have it in your possession, you got to use what I've given you. And when you begin to use what I've given you, you'll begin to see the manifestation of a new stream come open. Hallelujah. You'll begin to see the manifestation of a well of finances coming forth. Glory be to God. I've already given you what you needed. Come on. Some of us. Uh, oh, God. Some of us. Some of us, good morning, Russia. Some of us have old visions, old dreams, where we was birthing for products and merchandise 10 years ago, and we never gave away our equipment. And the Lord is saying, rebrand, 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 rebrand. Come on, rebirth. I've already given you the resources. Everything you need is already there. Come on. Go and, un go and unbox those supplies. They still good. They still workable. They don't have that much wear and tear on them. The Lord said, bring them out. Bring them out. Relaunch. Rebirth. Recreate. Recreate. That's what the Holy Ghost was saying. I've given you the new level of creativity for you to relaunch, rebirth, rebrand, rebuild. And the resources is already there for us, y'all. When the Lord started telling me that, all I could do was look and say, oh, my Lord. Oh, my Lord. Oh, my Lord. Everything. I'm saying I need this, Lord. I'm saying I need this. And he said, I've already given to you what you need. You have all the resources to birth forth the open doors that is already there for you. Come on. How many of you? online with me right now you got everything you need to rebirth relaunch restart the ministry go out to the highways and the byways and remarket the product that's already within you god has already given us the resources but how many of you needed the fresh revelation like the woman that god said to see that what you need was already in the house for you to open for it the business that is within you this one here is to rebirth and relaunch 
for the family lineage. This manifestation for the family lineage, y'all. The family lineage. When I say, the Lord said, he's going to give us the resources, the seed, the know-how to help us get our household to the next level. Come on. In 1 Timothy 5 and 8, is about household. We're about to manifest another level in our household. The resources for our household is about to be enlarged. The resources for our household is about to be ignited. We're not going to deny our household anymore. We're going to start using the resources that's in our house to manifest and bring back into our house. Am I saying it right? Am I saying it clear? Am I helping somebody that the resources is already in our house for us to open up the gate to the next stream to make it happen? Can, can, oh my God. Can we work on it the rest of this month? Pulling out and reorganizing what we already have to relaunch what needs to be relaunched, what needs to be surfaced in the earth realm. There is manifestation in what we already have. The resources is already here. Come on. And as I looked down just now and I seen two of my sisters commented and one raised their hand and one said, yes, ma'am. That's some t-shirt business women. God has gifted them to birth for the t-shirt business. Both of them together, y'all, got heat press machine. Both of them together got crooked. Both of them together got the equipment that they need to birth for it in the next level of the creativity. Open up the next level of stream in their households. So now it's time for us to understand how to apply the principle of the resources that's in our house. And we got to kick fear out of the way. We got to kick doubt out of the way. We got to kick procrastination out of the way. And we got to devour the word lack. Because there is more for our household. There is more for our lifestyle. There is more. Hallelujah. There is more happening in the spirit realm. And the Lord said the more is in us. We just have to pull it out. We just have to bring it. Come on. We got to bring the more out. It's been housed in us as a vision. It's been housed in us as a dream. Now it's time for the more to come out. How will the more come out? We got to bring the more to a reality. We got to bring the more to the storefront. We got to bring the more to the website. We got to bring the more and be the model that we are created to be. There is more. There is more in you. There is more in you. Glory to God. There is more within our loins. We got more. There is a greater vision than what we see. When he said, oh, my Lord, help me. Help me, Holy Spirit. He said, you seem small. When I'm seeing worldwide, you seeing small when I'm seeing corporation, you seeing small when I see development, you're seeing small when I see expansion, he, you seeing small when I see chain reaction. Come on. God wants to do more in your life. He wants to set you up in more locations. He wants to launch you in more levels. He wants to brand you in more arenas than what you thought you can go in. Come on. There is a more in the spirit. We got a local more. We got a global more. We got a worldwide more. We got an international more. We got a more. Come on. There is more in the rim. There is more. 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 There is more. More happening. More happening. There is a more. Come on. We prophesied it. There is a more in my belly. There is more in my dream. There is more in my vision. There is more in my creativity. There is more in my spirit that I can push out. There is a more in me. Come on. After today, we're going to give up the mediocre thinking. After today, we're giving up the baseline thinking. 
with the, when we in school, they taught us that anything above the number five is greater. Anything below the number five is less than. So we gonna move like the math teacher told us. We got to think over the level five and see that greater is our portion. We got to see greater is what's coming to me. We got to see greater has arrived. We got to see the more in our spirit. My mouth says more. My spirit says more. My elevation is more. My determination is more. My perseverance is more. My seeking is more. My creativity is more. My oil is more. My anointing is more. My development is more. There is more. I can possess more. I can own more. I can rule over more. Come on. There is more. Everywhere I turn, I'm going to see more. When I turn to the right, I see more. When I turn to the left, I see more. When I look to the hills which come in my health, I see more in the heavens. When my feet start to move, I see more. What happens? Increased territory. I see more dimensions. When I get on my social media platform, I see more clients. When I get on my social media platform, I see more soul salvations. For those of you that's in outreach ministry, there is more. Those of you that's launching and desire more clients, more customers, when I set forth my new design on my social media platform, I see more in my story. Come on here. When you see more, there is a more happening in the spirit. I ain't seeing less. I'm seeing more, 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 more. I see more. Come on. I see more. I decree more. He said the definition for more is greater. The definition for more is additional. So when I, come on, you the I, I'm the I. So when we launch forth the next level of the vision, we see more. Come on. Come on, we're going to prophesy. I see more souls. I see more clients. I see more customers. I see more patients. I see more. I see more. When I go out into the highways and the byways, when I go out into the marketplace, I see more. I have became a magnet for the kingdom that brings in more. Come on. More. I prophesy more over my life. Come on. I see more streams. I see more valleys. I see more green pastures. I see more elevation. I see more of my family being changed. I see more blessings coming to my family. I see more favor on my family. I see more grace on my family. I see more overflow on my family. I see more streams opening up for my family. I see more rivers coming together for my family. I see more of his anointing coming in my life. I see more of his fresh oil. I see more of God's wind blowing in my direction. I see whatever my more needs to be. I see more healing coming forward. Come on here. I see more. I see more. I see more. I see more. Come on. More. I see more. Mm -hmm. Come on. We see more. More is happening. More is on the horizon. Come on. In my horizon, I see more. Huh. Come on. More strength. Come on. We got more strength. We got more energy. More is in us to go to the next level. More is in us for the vision to be met. The resources is already available for our household. Come on. We got more. Come on. We got more coming to our household. Come on. We're going to prophesy it all over again. We got more coming to our household. I have more coming to my household. Everybody in my household is about to walk in the more season. Everybody in my household is about to walk into the greater. Come on. We got to prophesy it. More is in my family lineage. More is in my family lineage. More. He said, I'll give you more seeds to the sower. I'll give you more increase. I'll give you more. 
What did he say? There? I will supply all. All means more. We got to understand how to interpret these words in the next room. All means more. All means more is my portion. All means more is coming from God. All. All of my needs mean there ain't no lack in my house. There ain't no lack. Yeah, yeah, I said it right there. There ain't no lack. There ain't no lack. I'm saying it like that. There ain't no lack in my house. My house got more. My house got more. My house have more grocery. Come on here. Oh, come on. My house have more grocery. I don't know who needed the more in a refrigerator. Because I know our refrigerator right now is on empty. We need more. Come on. More. Come on. He shall supply more. More. Grocery. More. 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 We decree and we declare that more. That more. More. Come on. More. He's giving us more. More is available to us. For we decree and we declare more resources is coming available. Come on. I'm going to search the internet more. Ah, come on. My business women and men, we're going to search the internet more for grants. More grants to fund the vision of the outreach, to fund the foundation of the business. More. There is minority grants. More. Uh huh. I prophesy more grants and less loans. Come on. We got more. Come on. More business credit. Come on. More business credit. We're going to prophesy more. Come on. There's expansion on my business. More. There is more coming in the kingdom. More is the portion. More. More. My children are going to receive more college funding. Come on. More resources will come to my children that's in college. More. My high school children want to go to college. More resources is coming to my high, my college, my high school students. Come on, Angie, somebody. College. College school's coming up again. More resources is coming to my students. More resources is coming to my family. My children that's preparing to go to college. Higher learning institutes. More doors of financial revenue is coming in. No loans. We call it in grants. We call it in Pell grants. We call it in student grants. We call it in Coca-Cola's. Come on. Pepsi's. All these major corporations. We call it in the grants and the scholarships. Nothing to pay back. Come on. Y'all got it in your mouth. Y'all got it in your hands. Y'all got it in your loins. Call in the more. More money to pay my house note. More money to pay my car note. More money to seed into the visions. More money. Come on. More. Whatever your more is, begin to speak it. More. More to plant. More to sow. More to develop. More. More is my portion. More is my lifestyle. I receive more. I give more. Come on. We are in family lineage. My family lineage is getting more. Come on. Less medical bills and more resources. Ha! Huh? Less medical bills and more resources. Come on. More. More. Come on. Greater is more. Yeah, 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 yeah. Greater is more. Greater is more. Greater is more, y'all. Greater is more. Greater is upon us. There is a development of greater. Greater, come on. There is a greater more. Oh my God. I feel it in the Holy Ghost. There is a greater more in the spirit. There is a greater more in the spirit. More. More is in the spirit realm. More is in the development. More. More has come. More has come. Uh-huh. More, more, more. Hey, ba 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 shiata. We speak forth. We break forth the back of the enemy. That our finances, come on, will not be attacked. We're going to prophesy that. 
before we hit the lie. More is coming to us. And the enemy will not bring forth in his spirit to sabotage our increase in our finances. Come on. When the door opens for more, give us the wisdom to handle the more. That we won't run over or mismanage the more. Give us the wisdom to handle the more. Give us the wisdom to teach us how to invest in the more. Yeah, I, I, come on here, Holy Ghost. That's right. More community grants. Come on. Our community need development. Yeah, 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 yeah. Come on here. Thank you, sister. More grants for the community. More development in the community. Hallelujah. Yeah, I, 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 I need, we need that one. More grants for the community. More community development, y'all. Our communities need to be developed more. More development in our communities. Hallelujah. Thank you, Father, for that word that she released in the atmosphere. More finances in our community. More youth buildings in our communities. More educational oh, resources in our community. More, more. Ah, more. There's more. Come on. There's more that's available. Come on. Prophesy more. Good morning, Miss Bakersfield. Good morning. There is more. Good morning. There is more to what God has shown us. There is more to what's released into us now. There is more resources. There's more of a greater vision, more of a greater dream. Come on. He's given us the creativity. He's given us the ability to bring forth more. There is more. Ha, 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 bo, shiana. Come on. I'm trying not to go in the realms of tongues. But y'all, I feel it. There is more. 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 There is more in the spirit that God wants to bring us to. There is more that he wants to deposit into us. There is more. In the land of the living, there is more. He said, taste and see how good he is. There is more in his goodness. There is more in his favor. There is more in his mercy. There is more in his peace. There is more in his joy. There is more in his expansion. Come on. I need y'all to go with me to the more. He's going to the more. There's more. There's more. I got the power to pull down more in my life. I got the power to speak more in my life. I got the power to manifest more. More. More, more, more. Oh, Rabbi Shianda. More, 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 more. Come on. Greater is more. Multiply is more. Increase is more. His scripture tells us more, more. Come on. Let me get, let me, let me get up. Let me get to my, my Bible app right quick to make sure that I'm going to release the right scriptures of more. Deuteronomy 1 and 11. It talks about. The manifestation of a thousand times more. What, what happens? Your increase is a thousand times more. Your capacity is a thousand times more. Deuteronomy 1 and 11 tells us the blessings are going to come a thousand times greater. What is happening in a thousand times greater? There's more. More is coming to you. When you plant and when you sow, more is coming. Come on. Hallelujah. And as I heard the Lord say, when you plant and you sow, more is coming. What does he do? He give us the resources and his word tells us one plant, one water, and then God comes back and give the increase. Come on. Are you tilling the grounds? Are you plowing in the field for the preparation of your planting season? Come on. Are you plowing and tilling the soil for the preparation of your planting season? Because what is happening right now? I'm planting seeds in good grounds. I'm seeing the manifestation of the harvest coming in good grounds. And what is going to happen is somebody is going to come back and water the seeds that you have sown. And here comes the father coming into your life and watering with another level of increase. Come on. One plant, one water. And here comes the father. Come on. Come on. For y'all, Jesus, the Holy Spirit, Abba, comes with the increase. Come on. 
We got it going on now. Come on, somebody's planning, somebody's watering, and now God said it is your time. It is your arrival. It is your destiny. It is your season. It is your opportune time. It is your right now moment. It is your break forth moment. It is the cultivation of your time for you to come out. And what is happening in your come out? He is bringing forth more. He is bringing forth the increase of his word. Come on, to plant the water, the increase. One soul, one did this. Come on, we are in the season of God is getting ready to show you the more. Are you ready for your more? Are you ready for your exceeding? Are you ready for your Ephesians 3 and 20? Are you ready for your Psalms 68 and 19 lifestyle where daily he loaded me with benefits? What is happening daily? He's giving me more. That's what loaded me. More benefits is coming to you. Are you ready for the more lifestyle? Huh. I'm getting all excited all over again because I feel a more coming. Are you ready for the more? More in your spirit. More in your house. More in your family. Come on. More. You just planted. You just plowed into you. You just planted. Then the water came. And then God came and brought forth another level of increase. Come on. What happened in the increase? It became spontaneous. Cool. Oh, my Lord. You just got your spontaneous blessing. You just got a blessing that you didn't even realize that you had sowed a seed on. You just got a blessing that you didn't even realize that you planted on. You got a blessing that you didn't even realize had been spoken in the atmosphere. You spoke a word and said, Lord, this seed that I'm sowing, I speak for it. New beginnings and months them pass by and now is your opportune time where he's just opened up the level of resources, more resources to you. And that seed just came back to you and God gave you increase on that seed. You was waiting for a past due seed and the seed that you were supposed to get in December was going to be one amount. But God said now is the time and he put increase on the seed. He put a lump sum on the seed. He said people to overflow on the seed. He put a Ephesians 3 and 20. I'm going to give you abundantly. I'm going to give you an exceed of what you didn't even ask for, what you wasn't thinking, what you did not even imagine. It's about to come to you. There is an Ephesians 3 and 20 and more is about to happen. Come on. Daily. Come on. We got to prophesy that one. Daily he loaded us with benefits. My benefits is being loaded. Come on. For those of you, huh, let's go to the natural. My benefits is being loaded on my card. Come on. Daily he loaded new money on my card. Daily he loaded new money in my bank account. Daily he's giving me the resources that I need financially. When you make the products, when you sell what's in your house, the resources that's already there, you're going to see the more coming in. You're going to see the daily, I see the benefits coming in. You're going to see the manifestation of the new thing happening. Glory be to God. Are you ready for the more? Are you ready for the more? Thank you for wishing me my happy birthday. Today is my forever 25th birthday, y'all. Today is my forever 25th birthday. So I got more years added to my life. For the Lord says, long life. For the word says, according to Psalms 103 and 5, he will restore the years. Come on. So in my years being restored, I say more years is being added to my life. Come on, because our kingdom assignment has not yet been fulfilled. So we prophesy on this day as I celebrate my birthday and you celebrate the birthday with me. We celebrate together. More years is being added on to our lives in the name of Jesus. He is restoring the years that was lost because of the canker worm, because of the locusts, because of our foolish ways. And we were not mature. So we lost some years of our lives. But restoration came in 103 and 5. Come on, Psalms 103 and 5. He says, I will restore the years. Come on. How many of you with me this morning? Your years is being restored. More years is being added on to your life. He's adding more years to my life. Why? Because he sold me longevity is my portion. So I prophesy the key of rap portion is longevity. And everybody that's on the stream, longevity on your life. Your years is being restored. What you may have done then, restoration is upon you. There is more to my life. 
I'm going to take my story and allow it to be the next level of my testimony. Come on. I'm going to take my story and allow it to be the next level of my testimony. And in my testimony, I'm going to see the restoration. I'm going to give God glory. Why? Because my story is about to help bring more people come to God. My story is about to deliver somebody else out of their slump. My story is about to take somebody out their dark days and come into the light. My story is about to give somebody strength to rise up and see the next level of what God can do in the midst of what went wrong. There is a right in the wrong God is about to do something supernatural in the lives of his people get ready come on here in your day this morning as I tell everybody when we on y'all set for the daily affirmation so today my daily affirmation is I decree and I declare more years has been added on to my life and my life is full of longevity good health prosperity new beginnings more doors is opening up more windows of opportunities more gates is coming to my life why because my assignment is not yet done there is a more in my life and my more this find is greater is upon me my more is greater is within me my more is greater favor is upon my life greater grace is upon my life greater mercy is upon my life greater joy is upon my life greater peace is upon my life greater is on my life and my greater defined as more. Come on. Who need a more on today? Who need a more on today? More is my portion. More is my story. More is my lifestyle. More is within me. More of his spirit. Come on. More. It's motivational Monday. More. 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 When I see, I see more. Come on. When I see, I see more. Come on. When I see, I see more. Come on. Catch on to it. When I see, I see more. When I see, I see more. When I see, I see addition. When I see, I see an increase. When I see, I see multiplication. When I see, I see a thousand times. When I see, I see a hundredfold. When I see, I see increase. I see increase. I see increase all around. I see increase all around. I see increase all around. Come on. When I look around, I see increase. I see increase. 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 Come on. Increase. Oh, Baba When I look around, I see increase. I see increase, y'all. Increase. We decreeing and we declaring. Increase. Yeah, 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 yeah. Increases all around. Come on. I see increase all around. What will we see? Addition all around. I see multiplication all around. I see the Lord opening up a Psalm 68 and 19 for me. An increase of benefits coming to me. I see more in my Ephesians 3 and 20. Come on. I see more in my Psalms 114 and 15. I see increase. What happens in the increase in that scripture? He going to give it to me. He going to give it to my children. He going to give it to my grandchildren. He going to give it to my great grandchildren and the generations to come after. So there is more in my family lineage. There is a generational wealth in my family lineage. Come on. There is more than just my blessing. There's more on my children like, there's more on my grandchildren like, there's more on my great grandchildren like, and there's more on the generations to come behind. Our family lineage, come on, prophesied your last name and my married last name. I prophesied generational wealth is our portion. Come on, for my single sisters, we prophesied generational wealth on our birth last name, on our married last name. Come on. We speak for generational wealth. Even on our children, married last name. Come on. We prophesy it into the distance. We bring it forth manifestation of more to the whole lineage. The scriptures in 1 Timothy 5 and 8, he says, take care of our household. Take care of our family. So we prophesy it. More is coming to our family. 
More is coming to our household. More is coming to the lineage of our DNA. Our bloodline is blessed with more. More deliverance, more salvation, more healing. There's more in our bloodline. There is more. 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 Come on. There is more. Generational wealth. We have a request in the chats. More wisdom, more knowledge for the children that's going to be taking the 2024 testing. More wisdom, more knowledge, more understanding, more comprehension for the children that's going to be taking the test in this 2024 school year. More, more that their understanding will be open. Their skill set of creativity learning will flow more education more academics more 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 we speak for it more 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 god bless god bless god bless we're gonna close we're gonna close out on the more there is more in us more 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 yeah that's right that's right there is generational wealth. Come on, more on all our family lineage. Grandparent lineage, grandfather lineage, mama lineage, daddy lineage. Come on, more, more on our whole family line. There is a generational wealth in our family lineage. Our family is no longer seeing poverty. Our family lineage is no longer seeing lack. There is a more in the atmosphere. Greater is in the atmosphere. For our family lineage, greater, 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 greater. Ha ba 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 shianda la la baka, raba sika taba shianda. Greater is the portion. Greater, come on. Greater, greater, greater. Hallelujah, hallelujah, hallelujah. For those of you that may want to sow a seed into my life as my birthday, or you want to sow a seed into Sisters with Conquering Faith Outreach, you can go to the description. And you'll see all the information there. Or you can go to our website at www.swcfoutreach.org. It's www.swcf.org. And you can go there and you can click on the give link. And if you desire to plant a seed, we're going to be on April the 20th. That's going to be a Saturday. We're going to be doing our next round of Feeding the Season Saints. We're going to be going into another area on April the 20th to feed the Season Saints. For us, the Season Saints are our senior citizens in different communities that are homebound. We go in and we bring them a hot meal. So if you would like to plant a seed into that area of the outreach, you can go to www.swcfoutreach.org and you can put in your memo, Season Saints. You would like to place a donation to help us with the feeding of our next level of our season saints. We're outreach ministry and we're coming on live Monday through Friday at 5 a.m. Central Standard Time with a word of motivation, with a prayer, however the Holy Spirit leads us. We are here Monday through Friday at 5 a.m. So I wanna say thank you for all that came on. Thank you for all the likes. Thank you for all the comments. Thank you for all the subscriptions that you have released and to help us grow this platform. My name is Nakia Rapp, and if you would like to directly plant a seed personally into my life, go ahead and look in the description, and you'll see ways that you can cash out, Venmo, PayPal. Again, you can plant a seed into my personal life as the visionary of Sisters with Conquering Faith, or you can go ahead and plant a seed into our outreach to help us with our next upcoming projects that we're working on, which is to help feed our season saints on April 20th. And if there's anybody in our local area that would like to donate, feel free to reach out to me and contact me in regards to what's going to be on the menu. If you would like to help us with the grocery expense, God bless each and every one of you. And remember, there is more out there. There is more resources, more grants, more supplies. All we have to do is look and you will see the more is already there for you, that the Lord has already opened the door and supplied all of your needs. Your more is upon you. Your more is available to you. Thank you. Thank you. I see you saying enjoy your day. 
Thank you. Thank you for the blessings. Thank you all for the birthday wishes in the comments and the chats. God bless each and every one of you. But there is more. There is a greater. Come on. The more and the greater has arrived. We are living in our more. We are walking in our growth of our next level of greater grace, more grace, more favor. Come on. We got to work the favor that is upon our life. We got to work the grace that's upon our life. We got to work the power that we walk in. in. Excuse me. We got to work the leap of faith. It is a leap of faith move. God is calling us to a more. And in the more, he has already given us the resources to bring forth the next level. There is more within our loins. God bless. Be blessed and know that today is a day of more. He has given you more that you need. Just take the time to look around and you will see your more resources has already been supplied for you. According to Philippians 4 and 19, all of your needs, all of my needs has already been supplied. All I have to do is open up my eyes and I will see the resources all already there for me. God bless and see you all tomorrow.